finding a walkable community can be frustrating as fuck. Especially when you consider that a majority of North American cities look like this. But nevertheless, we want to live walkable because it connects us more closely to our surrounding community. And that's the good news. Human scaled spaces prioritize connections with people. And I don't know about you, but humans are super interesting. Being able to connect with them is invigorating. So then where do you even find these spaces? Hola. Buenas. Me gustaría un café con leche de avena, por favor. There are three possible solutions to finding walkable communities. And of course, the one that best fits you will be dependent on your preferences. First and foremost, you could move to a European city. They're well-established, well-known, and fairly easy to find information on. And not gonna lie, that's a fairly typical answer that we see nowadays online. Guilty as charged. But I get that that's not attainable for everyone, nor is it something that everyone wants. And that's okay. Yes, it has this old world charm and offers great examples for what human scaled spaces can look like. But moving here does have its challenges. Be it cultural or otherwise, you should always assess whether that's the right decision for you and your family to make a big jump, like moving abroad. So what's next? You could move to a big city. It has more amenities, more activities, and a closer proximity, given it's a lot denser. For some of you, that may not feel right either. This option is best suited for people interested in big city life or financially in a place to make that kind of move. And that's not a bad thing per se, it's just people wanting different lifestyles given the fact that there's seven billion plus of us on this planet. It's natural that not everyone's gonna to want to move to a big city. Now, you may argue that some of these cities really aren't that pedestrian friendly, but many are jumping headfirst into developing more human skilled places and better transit infrastructure to offer better living experiences to current and future residents. But if Europe and the big city aren't really for you, then where do we look? a little secret and I'm super excited to tell you about it. Okay, so a friend of mine and a fellow urbanist enthusiast who also makes content on the internet, well, he did a really cool thing. You see, he and I were frustrated that it felt so difficult to find walkable cities in the US, as I'm sure many of you feel. He had the brilliant idea to take his skill sets and create this amazing tool that basically takes in a bit of information about you and Taylor makes a list of walkable places that would be great for you to potentially live in. It's six questions long and asks things like, what part of the country do you want to live in? How big of a city are you looking for? And what hobbies are you most interested in doing? And I should know that this is only available in the US at the time of making this. Th this is not sponsored by the way. I just really believe that the members of this community who are also doing incredible things need to be highlighted. And Grant, the friend who made this is completely aligned with that mission. The website's called Friendly Towns and I've linked it below if you're interested in checking it out. It's really an incredible, incredible tool that I wish I had access to back when I was studying in college and potentially looking to live in the US. So a huge shout out to Grant. Please go let him know over on his pages and definitely check out Friendly Towns and let me know what you guys get in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys soon.